Come on, Mike. Yeah. Uh, it'd be good if it take the the, car, the screen off. Yeah. Hey guys, you alright? God bless you. God bless Jesus. God bless. Have a nice day. God bless. No, have a nice day. God bless. God bless. God bless. Well, why are you guys here then? I'm here to tell you about Jesus, that he died on a cross for your sin. That if you come to him, you'll find life and joy and peace. All right, it's good, mes good message. Jesus. Jesus. All the way to God is Jesus Christ. And we're here today to talk to you. Come on. Come on. God bless, have a nice day. Have a nice day, God bless. There's only one true God in his name, Jesus. Go for it, lads, whatever you got, let me hear it. Jesus. Have a lovely day, guys. God bless you. Have a lovely day, guys. Jesus. Well, no, 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 no. Jesus. He died for you. He died. Yes. Yeah, he died for you. Yes. Trust in him as your Lord and Savior. God bless you, Lord. Keep trust in Jesus. Amen. God bless. Have a nice day, sis. Michael, I want you to speak a bit louder. Up your volume. All right, yeah, yeah. Extend your voice. Okay, yeah. Hi guys. All right, thank God you. bless you. Have a nice day. And you. God bless Jesus. God bless. We're here today to tell you about Jesus. That Jesus died to save you today. You come to Jesus, you come to know him as your Lord and Savior. Have faith in Jesus, trust in Jesus Christ the Savior. He gave his life for you on that cross. He gave his life for you on that cross. He died to save you from the wrath to come. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son. God bless you. Thanks, love. Thank you. God bless. Assalamu alaikum. God bless you.
Come and join us at Hyde Park in October. <laughs> For the rumble in the jungle. Speaker's Corner. <laughs> Speaker's Corner. God bless you ladies, have a lovely day. Jesus died for you. Jesus died for you ladies. Hey man, you alright? God bless you. God bless you. Have a nice day sir. Have a nice day ladies. God bless you. Have a nice day ladies. Every knee will bow and every tongue will confess that Jesus Christ is Lord and to the glory of God. There's only one name in heaven in which we must be saved, and that's the name of Jesus. Amen. Have a lovely day, sir. He's the same today, yesterday, and forever. The word of our Lord stands forever. Amen. Well, all you Muslims out there, Surah 6:34. It says, "My word cannot change." You read the context; it's about messengers. It's saying the Bible cannot change. So why do you say the Bible can change when Surah 6:34 says it can't? You need to read the Bible, folks, and turn to the Lord and find salvation. He is the way, the truth, and the life. For you atheists out there, answer this, the transcendental argument. If logic is immaterial, how do you get the immaterial in a material universe? We as Christians believe God is spirit, and we believe in immaterial things, so we can account for logic. So answer the transcendental argument, atheists. You need Jesus to trust him as your Lord and Savior. Only he has the answer for your life. He is the way, the truth, and the life. You need him. God bless you. God bless you, mom. We found peace, we found hope, we found forgiveness, we found life, we found peace, love, joy, that's what we found in Christ. That's why we're out here, to share that peace, to share that love, to share that unsurpassing love and peace. That's why we're out here, we have a message to give, a message of life and hope and peace to know the living God who came down in Jesus and died on that cross to save us that's why we're out here we're not here to play games we're here to take over we're here to take over the nation and share the gospel so why are you in church sat on your bottom get out and share the love of God get out and share the love of God you say you believe the Bible, the Bible says people are going to hell. But you don't believe the Bible, because you don't believe there's a hell. If you believe there was a hell, and people were going to hell, you'd be out here. You pastors, you like to wear the dark color, you like to wear the suit, you like to be called a pastor, but when was the last time you got off your butt and got out there and preached the gospel and shared the love of God? When was the last time you gave a tract or spoke to someone about Jesus? Get out and share the love of God. People need Jesus. You Christians out there, give to missionaries. Give to the work of God. And get out. There's a dying world out there. And they need the mercy and message of God. Get out and share the love of God. They're falling over the cliff to hell. 
and you're playing a footling, playing, twiddling your thumbs. When people are going off the cliff into hell. So come out here and talk to people. Show them that you care. Take a table to a town or a village. Put some books on it, some tracks, and share the message. God bless you.